Hello everyone, today we will discuss how to interpret a chest x-ray in a very simple way by following a few basic steps. So let's get started. So first of all, we will look for the identity of the patient. So this is a chest x-ray of Muhammad Abbas, 26 years old. Next step is projection that either your chest x-ray film is AP or PA view. So this is a PA view. The third step is to check the rotation of the film. For this we will see the clavicle, medial end of the clavicle, they should be equidistant from the adjacent spinous process. So as you can see, the film is non-rotated. Fourth step is to check the airway. So we will see that the trachea should be central. It can be deviated in any pathological conditions. So fifth step is to check the lung fields. So the lung fields are clear on both sides. There is no opacity. After that we will count the ribs. 4th, 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th. So 8 to 10 ribs are normal or inspiration. This is the <coughs> costophrenic angle that is made by the hemidiaphragm with the lateral chest wall. So on both sides it is normal, not obliterated. Then this is the cardiophrenic angle. It is also normal. Sixth step is the cardiac size and the borders of the heart. This is left and this is the right border. After that, seventh step is to look for hilum. So on both sides, the hilum is normal looking. Hilum is the structure where your veins and arteries enters into the lungs. It is mostly K or C shaped. So at the end we will do the interpretation so this is a chest of muhammad abbas 28 years old pa view non-rotated film both lung fields are clear costophrenic angles appear normal cardiac size is normal heart borders are prominent hilum appears normal on both sides so in this way you can interpret a chest x-ray very easily so this is a chest x-ray of a normal person but in case of any pathology if you know the normal you can differentiate or appreciate the pathology thanks for watching my video